our third semi-finalist, representing Koi MMA, make some noise for Gary McDonald! His opponent and our final semi finalist, make some noise for Elliot Edwards. All right, guys, so we've got the next, uh, next matchup, next semi-final for you guys today. We have Gary McDonald in the blue corner coming up against Elliot Edwards in the red. Both of these guys came through a huge, huge slugfest in their previous rounds. Um, they're going to be carrying a little bit of damage, a little bit of pain, a little bit of sore into this, into this, this fight. This is scheduled for one five But they both are, so it shouldn't of give anyone too MMA. much of an advantage or disadvantage. So here we go, semi-final number two for us. Um, Elliot Edwards with a bit of a height and reach advantage and uh, Gary McDonald, the Taekwondo specialist. Making sure this kicks early. Yes, he is. Nice right hand from Elliot. Good left hook and flurry from Gary. So a bit of a chop and change with the commentators tonight. We have Clark Jarrett back again with Nick Allen. Um, we have a couple more fights left before the main event. We have a kickboxing uh, showcase after this fight between Romeo Power from Core MMA and Hinare Verko, who's travelled from Fakatane MMA. Using those low kicks to try and stop the advantage from the, uh, using that highest advantage to keep it on the outside. Yeah.
Elliot definitely uh, channeling his inner Diaz brother. <laughs> I think he's mentioned uh, many times that's who he looks up to, the Diaz brothers and his fighting style. And he's showing a lot of that tonight. When you got that sort of body shape, no better person to look to. Absolutely. Oh, good. Oh, left hook lands for Gary after taking a bit of a flurry. Oh, he's... Elliot looks like in a bit of trouble, but he's doing well. Gary just keeps on coming. Definitely keeping that pace up after that Gordy first fight. It's good to see. Yeah, it is. It's interesting. How long will he be able to keep it up? He's very well conditioned, prides himself in his fitness. Both of these guys are huge hard, hard workers. A few knees to the body there will change anyone's condition, though, that said. Absolutely would. Elliot trying to use his front kicks and his round low kicks to keep him at bay. Very evenly matched thus far. It is. I think that's uh, one, the good, a good thing about this eight man is that all these matchups have been really, um, really even. So at the uh, weigh-ins yesterday, everyone comes in, weighs in, draws names out of the hat. It's very much like that format. Yeah, it is cool. Very exciting. You see Gary's hands are starting to drop. He's starting to breathe heavy. Those front kicks taking their toll. Elliot's still coming forward. Good right hand. Oh, another good one. Oh, he's clipped again. The longer man, Elliot definitely knows where his range is. He does. He's doing well to keep him at bay. But the speed of Gary seems to surprise him as well when he comes in. Mixing it up well there as well. Threatening some kicks, throw some hands. Yeah. Making use of the different punches as well. Coming with an uppercut. Coming around with hooks. Mixing it up. Something that Gary's not doing as much as I thought he would. Using mostly straight punches. Um, not utilizing too many kicks. Maybe he doesn't want to get taken down. Oh, good left straight. Elliot's just keeping the same pace. He doesn't look like he's lit up at all. He's carrying on, plugging away. It can be very de demoralizing to come up against as well. As you start and drain, you see the other fella just doesn't stop. Yeah. Um, yes, e e Elliot, I think he's mentioned before how he, he runs hills. He's biking, huge biking, um, um, huge bike rides and um, long, long runs. He prides himself on his conditioning, so it's, it really is showing tonight. Not just his fighting style he takes from those Diaz boys. Yeah, for sure. Oh, excellent trip. Oh, no, Gary oh, finds himself on top and mount. Big turn of events here. If he postures up and throws some punches, we could be looking at a finish. 10 seconds left, so Gary's finishing really strong. He wants to posture up. He wants to make a statement here at the end of the round. He wants Definitely good way to finish there. Oh, there he goes. This is going to be so hard to score. Time! This, I mean, who, who can just say won this one? Uh, it's not my job to call that one, man. I'm just enjoying this show. Yeah, Great same fight. with me. I'm glad that I'm not, I'm not making that decision tonight. Sporadic activity from Gary. Some good flurries and um, did rock him. Didn't drop him, but he did rock him. Um, but a consistent flow of punches and kicks coming from Elliot. So it, this is super hard to call. I, I don't know. And I'm, as you said, I'm glad I'm not calling it. Showing a replay of the use of that range there is really good. Yes, he did very well. I personally, if I had to, I think I'd lean towards Elliot. His activity was so high. He didn't get into too much trouble with the takedown at the end. Um, I think he's done enough, but I would not be surprised or disappointed if um, Gary took it away because he worked super hard as well, landed some awesome shots, um, some good flurries. So either man um, can say that they 
did their, did, did, did their all tonight Definitely. in this fight, and uh, I'll be interested to see who comes away with the win. Oh, there was the rock the there. Hobble. Yeah. I definitely think uh, Elliot had a higher work rate and landed more, but Gary did land some big All shots. right, fighters yeah, in the middle, is, please. Yeah, Our winner by unanimous decision and going on to the final, fighting out of the blue corner, Gary McDonald. So Gary's taking it away. The judges liked what they saw. So they like the big statement. Bring it um, in, Gary, bring it in. The Just quickly before we let you go and have a quick rest. That was a tough bout. Take down to the end. Elliot is a very tough comp competitor. And clearly, guys, you know, the level of MMA for you guys that haven't been in the ring before is truly outstanding. Have you got any comments? I mean, it was a tough, tough hitter. I knew that if I um, took him for granted, he could possibly come in and finish me with a single hit. Um, but he, he was seriously a tough competitor. Well, congratulations. We'll see you in the final. Round of applause, Gary McDonald. So we have